Jeez, Josh, once again, brother, you've outdone us all. I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh, shh. <sighs> Don't you guys think this is a little bit cruel? Oh, come on. She deserves it. It's not her fault that she has a huge crush on me. Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. I am. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling.
Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Hey, Hannah. I got your note. Glad you can make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. She's taking her shirt off. <laughs> Hannah, Hannah, hey, honey, don't. It's just a stupid prank, okay? Oh, I'm sorry, Hannah. This all got out of hand. Are jerks. You know that? Hannah! Josh! Josh! Fuck! Hannah! What's going on? Where's she going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? She's messing around, Dad. It wasn't serious. You jerks! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Hannah! Ah! Hannah!
Anna? Anna, where are you? Anna! Anna! Flo? Anna! Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take me coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Anna? Beth? Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. 
And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. No, oh, that's good. In what way did it make you happy? Sunshine. <laughs> I see. So which word? would best describe how you feel about darkness. <laughs> well, winter nights are cold and dark. Depression, feelings of loneliness are not uncommon. This night in which your game takes place is particularly cold and dark. I would think that you might feel Isolated at times. Does that bother you? Well, not much of a people's person, are we? <laughs> well, it seems we have uncovered a significant topic to explore in our next session, but for now, we're out of time. Have fun on your own. Until then. <sighs> year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Sheriff Annie Klein, who's in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. 
There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Anne. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Ah! <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this and that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! What? Fella, you hungry? Huh? 
<laughs> Cutie. <laughs> cool. You here? Oh. Hey then. this. Beauty all the way up here. bag are you hello what do we have here So, 
I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. W where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right. Here goes. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Your ass just got sacked. Hey, sharpshooter, our ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Here you go. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Real gentlemen. I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. It's so beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing, like a sleeping giant. You gonna publish? What? Your pretty poem. The Sleeping Giant of Blackwood Forest. Oh, shut up. Crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some seeds, but okay. Mm, 
wouldn't just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I, I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, and I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. You know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. People. Time to meet and greet. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Jess, hey! Jessica, over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> Well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa, drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. All right, all right, let's just get up to the lodge already to get tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget it, to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the evil car ends? I don't think it would have been like as pretty, you know? And where's the bellboy when you need one? Getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Yeah, 
you guys. Michael. You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. Michael, you gotta step off. Emily and I are together now, and that's just the way it is. I'm not gonna tell you again. Do we understand each other? Well, I thought maybe we could move past all this. Be buds, but yeah, fine. Mike. No, no, no. No, it's totally cool. I'm just gonna head down the road, be all mature and shit by myself over here. Peace. I think you got the message. It's kinda hot when you get all alpha, you know that? Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you? take these the rest of the way. The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. OK. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. All right, fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, the more even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. Hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! Oh! <laughs> hey. hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare my you. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, damn. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh, right. oh, son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. God I... damn it. Matt. Just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> hey! Oh! <laughs> Ray. Hey, you know that? 
Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Oh! Ah. Hi! Hey! Got me. Fair enough. Okay. <laughs> You're going down. <laughs> oh. Gotcha. It's done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right. All right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Again. And how are we feeling? Hmm? I felt that we made some good progress in the last session. But I'm grown concerned about your situation. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book. Turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience.
This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Snakes, clowns, an awful. The sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> Uh, well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? It feels the same to me. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here, okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. You doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. Is it iced? What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be, like, a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Matt! Been a while. Rough season, huh? Yeah. Something like that. You okay, man? Some people, you know? You think you know them? Okay. So, oh. see Nash yet? Um, yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. How's, uh, how's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off her? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. 
Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. We got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. Well, what, what is it? Okay, so. I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. here.
Huh. That's cool. was that? Chris, very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it.
What the fuck? Ah. Perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> <sighs> Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Yeah, come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Mike, stay away from our girlfriend. Dude, what are you talking about? Stay away from Emily. Emily? Why would I want anything to do with Emily? But being such a dick, man. Nobody wants you here. Seriously, what's your problem, meathead? Son of a bitch! Hey, hey, get off me! Hey! What the hell is wrong with you two? I mean, we didn't come back here just to tear each other's heads off. I mean, we came back here to have a good time, right? Hey, Mike, why don't you and Jess go check out the guest cabin I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, cool. You wanna head up there? Sure. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my God, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. <sighs> Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works. Ugh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes on. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars, you're gonna need these. Porn star? I pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No.
hot lips. Photo booth. All right, read my mind. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. What the heck was all that muscle flexing back there with you and Matt? A dick, right? Dude has no business coming at me like that. He's got any brain and that huge dumb melon. He better find it and use it or he's gonna get wrecked. Wow, nasty Mikey. Just riled up. Me likey. Nice one, Mikey. Yeah. Woo! You are a wizard! No, this is awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hits. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. <laughs> Beth. You'd think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. I barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault. They ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? Hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Damn. 
I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will find another way around. Jessica! Yep! Hey! Um, okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Coming after you. Just stay put. Hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? Help me move it. Help me move it. When I imagined us grunting together, this is not what I pictured. <laughs> Insurance. We'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. We're getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? rubber. Finally, a 
little ray of hope. Well, well, when Josh said cabin, I thought like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Eh, you can take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. All right. I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> Sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. I... Uh, maybe. answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah, you got a lot of love to give. <laughs> I'm scared. Damn it, Josh. Wouldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? Really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Okay, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? Yes!
get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy har. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. much hmm. hello could this be any more about Mike
pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board. A what? Wow, you have a spirit board? <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're... Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Hey, Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric <laughs> ward before Chris makes a move. Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... <sighs> what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. I'll, I'll be honest. It's definitely weird being back here, but I think it'll help us all put everything behind us. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality. Right, Sam? Anyway. I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you, can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing.
nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mmm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Okay, I'm mean, just try again. Ugh. Relax. It's not that hard. Just press the button when the light comes on. Okay, okay, okay. I'll get it this time. First point. Does it start at 30? No, 15. Oh. Oh, more of a ping pong, yeah. <laughs> Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Josh. What? The rest of them like weirdly regular. No, not, nothing regular about it. Maybe we should go check it out. Why? I don't know, what if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. <laughs> nice, nice one. That was good. Wait, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor to it. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. Okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Hmm. You know what? You know what? No, no. 
I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Hello, Earth to Matt. You gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. What's your deal? What? I've never seen you get so aggressive. Mike was being a prick. Newsflash, gentle giant shows a not so gentle streak. Local lady swoon. Here you are, madam. Why, thank you, sir. Hey, M. Yeah? So what'd you ever see in Mike anyways? Oh, Matt. Seriously, he's a dick. He's always been a dick. Why are we talking about this? He's still into you. It's obvious. You're a big, strong, handsome man, and you're the one that I want, so stop worrying about Mike, okay? Okay. Hey, Doofus, come this way. You, uh, trying to get me somewhere private? Why don't you, uh, come find out? Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. It's no problem, babe. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. You gonna back that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Like, all day long. I was being, like, sexy. out here tonight. Wow. Yeah. It's so nice to be here with you, muscle man. Uh, I'm not all muscle. There are some brains in here, too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. 
Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this off for us. Like a gentleman. Well, come on, let's look around. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off, anyways. Maybe I want to show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. Sexy kisser on this thing. Dare to put your hand in it. Hey, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. Ah! <gasps> Emily! Emily! <laughs> gotcha, big dip. Jesus, you're ridiculous. Oh, come on. Who is that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal or... Do not like. Madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. That was not there before. Is that a note? Oh. Uh... It's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed.
I would like to understand your feeling toward people who fear failure and worry about what others think of them. Do you share this fear? <sighs> Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value? What you respect in yourself and others? Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? So, you would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then? And charity? Charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Oh, well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay, uh, is anyone there? Hello? Pick up the phone, spirits, spirit phone. Um, abracadabra. Come on. Um, if you can hear my voice, give us a sign. Yeah, like a peace sign or a stop Guys, sign. If you're not gonna take this seriously. Okay, okay. Is anyone there? Wherever there is. <sighs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's... It's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Who are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Hannah? 
Hannah, if you can hear this, like, really hear this, we all want to apologize for what happened. It, it was stupid and, and mean, and we're sorry. We're so sorry, Hannah. B? <sighs> e? T? R? Uh-uh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Uh, it's still going. Oh, God. K? I? L? L? E? D? No. Kill. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down, OK? Just we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am so guys, guys, sorry. What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. OK. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library B here? B? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library. Holy shit. Chris? You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, look, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need fault. this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Sh should we go after him? Ah, oh, man, I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. If, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Jess! Oh! Jess? Jess? Buddy, you in there? Ah! Whoa! Christ! I scared the blue out of my jeans. <laughs> what the hell is that doing in there anyway? Jessica? Oh, come on. Jess? Hun? Light of my life? Seriously? This is not funny. I totally promise I won't murder you when I find you. Oh, no! oh my No. I'm not Look, seeing it. No, no, no. no. <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just no. jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. That it's so scary. Good. I'm sorry to oh, scare you. If you send that to anybody, <gasps> you're I'm what? Gonna kill you. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm gonna see this thing. Oh, where's the delete button? Is this it here? No, 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 no. It's not funny. It's not funny. But you look so cute when you're scared. 
I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like Scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. All right, fine. You win. It's not a contest. But I do win. Uh-huh. Every time. Whatever you say, babe. Well, well, well. Look at this fun little lovebird carving. An M and an E. Any idea what that could stand for? Ah, oh, could be any, you know, Elizabeth and, and my room. <laughs> or maybe Michael and Emily? Relax. I just didn't realize you were so sappy. Pun intended. I came up here with them last year, but seriously, do you... I look like the kind of guy who carves hearts on trees? <laughs> I wouldn't have pegged you for a sissy screamer either, but can you ever really know a person? It had to be M. She can get all gross and mushy. Yeah, sure, sure. like a real winter wonderland out here now. Hey, girl, you know I hooked you up? <laughs> mm-hmm. Was it someone screaming? No. No. Uh, probably just a squirrel or something. Freak town. <laughs> Hello! 
Someone there? Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. I want to know. It's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Under control. Whole time. <laughs> Bullshit. No, hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred and ten. Holy crap! I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, got to be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things are not gonna come barging in. I promise. How can you be sure? Cause I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. 
Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. My yeah. fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Unless you want to make out with an ice sculpture, I suggest you get a fire going. Pronto. All right, logs are ready to go. Just need a match. Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, OK? Yes. slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can't find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh, shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. OK, OK. Well, I'll help you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. Fine. Looky, looky. Who's going to fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think... Well, I, I wish we had some booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of just... I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please. <laughs> There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. <laughs> I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is.
Voila. Shutters are shutted. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm really kind of insecure. Janice, you've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah. I guess I do. Yeah. And that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you, too. I am definitely ready to be handled. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. Do you really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know. I don't know if I wish they were or if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... I think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters. I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far.
Okay. I think so. Look. What? There was something behind the books. What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Oh, panel opens. Head explodes. Are we, like, in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's a rom-com. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. Gee, thanks. Whoa. What? Whoa, is what this... What did you find? Holy cow. And now, Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I, I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. So, that would be really messed up. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, the bad karma goes back a long way. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? There was, like, this wanted poster, like, full-on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what, you're saying there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? There was a message on this answering machine I found, and it... It, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just gotten out of prison and that there was nothing he could do. Well, what do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. Well, there was that guy I told well, you about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. You hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! We're coming! Hold on! Ah! Ah! Ashley! 
Ashley! Ash, what's going on? Let me in! Ashley! Are you okay? I'm gonna... Ash? Ash? I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know and like. Maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. Tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? Oh, full of surprises. I think I'm beginning to understand you far better now. Oh, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time. Don't be too hard on Joshua. He's been through, he's been through so much. But you know that already, don't you? Jessica! 
Jessica! Go, Mikey boy. Jessica. Oh my god. Jess! Jess! Are you okay?
Safety first. Yeah, that's our motto. Mm -hmm. Ash! Ash! Not good. Not good at all.
What the fuck? Oh shit. No. Ashley! Ashley? Anyone out there? Ashley? Ash. 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 Ashley? Ash? Ashley! Fred! Uh, Ash, I'm here! Hey. God damn it! Please, help me! Uh, I'm coming, Ash. Just, uh, just keep talking to me. What happened? Chris, tied me up. I can't move. Ashley, I'm gonna get you out of this. Don't worry. Two test subjects. 
Joshua, and Ashley. What? Oh my god. But we're gonna need one more brave participant to help decide which subject will live and which will die. Oh no! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, Chris! Oh, Get you can't do out this! Let me down from here, you maniac! Please, please, everyone calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will save. Okay, 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 this is gonna be okay. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Dude, buddy, oh let's just God. think about this for Chris, a minute. You can't let me die. Just give me a second, I, 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 uh, huh? I can't think straight. Huh? Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. Oh, no. thank you. Please, no. Josh, what, dude? He said, Wait, not what? right in front of us, man. What are the, you talking the, the about? Maniac. The, maniac. Oh my God, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. The maniac. What? And he was there was a sign. <laughs> it was either him or Ash, and I, I don't know. Oh what God. To do. <laughs> Come right through, man. Spill it out, fucking everywhere. What? Oh my God, Chris. What? And I, I killed him. What, oh, Chris? I, I killed him. It was my fault. Man. No, no, this is insane. We need to go get some help. We go right in half. We're gonna figure this out, man. Matt, we need to go get help now. Em, we should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is? I think she's in the lodge. Fine. Fine, you're right. Get everyone else together, but if there's a maniac running around, I think we need to get some help, too, right? Not just wait around. But what about... Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! are getting pretty tense up there, aren't they? Is the night going the way you hoped it would? Hmm. I see. And you think that these poor people are getting what they deserve? I'm trying to help you. And this game you're playing... You understand that it's not good for you. It's not good for anyone. And I can't say that you're being particularly honest in the way you're playing. <sighs> Do you intend? 
intend to continue with this elaborate self-indulgence? Do you even believe that I am real? Ow! The heart of the problem, it all comes down to this. Can you really tell the difference anymore? I doubt it. What went on here? This is nuts.
to take a peek inside? That's different.
intrigue on Blackwood Mountain. Huh? Oh shit. Gross. snooping around this paradise.
This place just gets better and better. Get on a shingle. Fucking hell. What's up, Chatterbox? Hanging out? Two. in here. Oh, my God. 
Oh. You need a smoker. Locked.
can't believe Josh is dead. I can't believe how he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really true. I, I don't know. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. Yeah, I guess, but some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take their word for it. Look! An axe. I feel better with an axe. Oh, what now? This is locked, Matt. We'll break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. We start smashing shit down, he's gonna hear us. Well, you got any better suggestions? I don't know. About... Look! What? A window. <laughs> That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. Oh, come on. You will never fit through there, big guy. I won't fit, but you will. Are you nuts? You're gonna shove my ass through that little hole? I've seen you slip into some pretty tight jeans, Em. Uh, excuse me? It's a talent. Fine, let's do it. Hmm. I'm right here, Em. I can't see anything. There's so much crap in here I keep bumping into. It's okay. Can you find the latch? Uh, anything. No, Matt, I think there's spiders in here. Be careful. Well, it's hard to be careful when it's freaking pitch black, you dead. Hey, I'm, I'm just trying to be helpful. Almost. <laughs> Almost. Ugh. did it. Good job, Em. You rock. You're okay, too. That was good. You did good. A++ plus plus would buy again. Oh. Damn. What happened? This is crazy. We were here just a few hours ago. This must have just happened. What the fuck is going on? It's got to be the guy, the, the one who... Who got to Chris and Ash and Josh? He's got to know this is the only way back. Wait, don't say that. Look, the cable car's all the way out there. Well, that's... I, I mean, that's not far, right? You you can jump it? <laughs> I'm good, Em. But not that good. Flattered, though. Well, Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we gonna do? I, I don't know. God, everything is, like, so busted up. I think they knew exactly what they were doing. Someone really did a number on this joint. Such a mess. This place was barely in working condition before, and now...
Hey, look! Fire tower. Hey, Magellan, maybe we should get the cable car working and take the show on the road, huh? Okay, there's got to be something we can do. Great. No keys, no cable car. So, back to square one. <gasps> what about the fire tower on, on the map you found? Well, I, I guess it's an option. Oh, maybe it has a radio or, or something. I mean, it, it would, wouldn't it? Probably, yeah. Matt, we gotta get to that radio. I don't know him. I mean, that could work, but I, I kind of think that, that maybe we should get back to the lodge for now. I mean, everyone, everyone's been split up for so long. Wait, for real? What is it with you and going back to the lodge? You just want to hide out in your room and cry. What? No. Don't be a pussy. We ought to do this, Matt. Fine. Fine. Whatever you say. What's cooking? Good looking? <laughs> Getting us out of here, Mr. Meat for Brains. Ugh. 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 Look at this bad boy. You're coming with me, buddy. And just like magic, come on down. We can totally get out here this way. You're all right. Yeah. Uh, thanks. Maybe um, you should go first to protect me. Okay. Okay, easy now. Almost. Almost. I'm feeling kind of faint. Don't look down. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Holy cannoli, thank God that's over. Yeah, for real. doesn't work. What? The radio. It'll work. But if it doesn't, we need a plan. Maybe we can just climb down. Climb down what? The mountain. Are you serious? What's the big deal? It, it's not like it's floating in the sky. <laughs> it might as well be. It's pitch black out. Hey, hopefully we won't have to. You think the psychopath is just going to give up and run away? No. But maybe we should find a safe spot. Hold up, wait it out. It'll be a lot easier to figure this all out in the morning. As long as we don't hide in the lodge, that's where he expects us to go.
just another option. The sanatorium we saw on the map. Hannah, I think that place is pretty abandoned. If they wouldn't have built a place like that on a mountain without some emergency contact to the outside world. Yeah, I mean, you might be right, but I have no desire to go spooking around in that place. Let's put it in the maybe column. Watch where you step around here, Emma. Yes, Matt. Given the choice, I prefer not to spend my evening plummeting to my death off a snowy cliff top. Hello? Guys? What are you doing out there? Being creepy? Okay. My clothes, really? Whichever one of you did this is off my Christmas list. Seriously, not cool, guys. Not cool at all. Chris, Mike, Emily, this is really getting out of hand, okay? It was all very funny, haha. -ha. Look at Sam walking around in a towel, but now I just really want this to be over, all right? You had enough? Can I have my clothes back now, or am I supposed to hang out in a towel for the rest of the weekend? A towel it is, then.
So what do we have here? Okay, if you were trying to freak me out, guess what? You succeeded. Wasn't it? 
it. Well done. The game seems to be going very well. Yes. All the good work we did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm-hmm. Your overwhelming fear of failure. You have turned it against these people who you so desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? Slow. It's okay. Come on. It's okay. If we do manage to get someone on the radio... We will. ...then we tell them we need help. But what do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge and get everyone else. Oh, God, not the lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio working first. Kidding. I can't see. What is that? It's just a security light. Motion sensor, probably. Super weird.
Why is it so windy all of a sudden? We're almost inside. Yeah. So, no power. <sighs> Sorry, Hannah, you're still missing too. Take this, might need it. Aye, aye, Captain.
We need help, please. My name is Emily. Hello? You're not coming through clearly. Please repeat. Over. Oh, God, please. Oh, my God. We're going to die up here if you don't come get us. There's a maniac. Don't you understand? Something tricked the motion sensor. Probably a fucking deer. I read you, ma'am. Please do not leave your position. We will send out <laughs> helicopters to get you as soon as the storm has subsided. <laughs> what? When? How long? Dawn? At the earliest? Not until dawn.
She wasn't up there? I don't know. I didn't see her. She must have come down here. I haven't seen her either. <gasps> Did that just happen? Damn it. What is going on around here? say what happened back there in the shed i know how hard that was josh was your friend actually stop no i want to say i mean thank you thank you for saving my life ash what was i gonna do okay i i i couldn't let anything happen to you i couldn't ash you all right yeah i just i know you and Josh were close, Chris. Let's just find Sam, okay? That, that's what we're doing. I mean, oh my God! Ashley, just stop, okay? I don't want to think about what just happened. Chris! We're finding Sam! Look at this. Chris, what happened here? I'm no forensics expert, but it looks like it was thrown. Stop. Ah! Wait a minute. Did you just see that? Uh, did, did I see what? That, Chris, that! What that was that? It was shape like a ghost oh boy i'm serious why don't you believe me i said i saw it doesn't that count for anything we, we've been through hell tonight okay your mind is fried my mind is fried i i don't even trust what i've been seeing no you are wrong i saw it and i am sure chris all right, all right. Maybe, maybe it's, maybe you did see something. Let's just, let's just keep our heads. Are we going crazy down here? It, it's, it's the only place left Sam could be, Ash. I wish we could just go find everyone else and- What if Sam needs us? What if she's in trouble? Oh, God. <laughs> let's go.
gotta be kidding. What the hell is going on? Oh, <gasps> oh my god, that scared me. How, how did everything get so freaky around here? Doors slamming and candles lighting up out of nowhere and that, that specter or whatever Ashley, it was. I, I, I think you're kind of ignoring what's really happening here. Don't tell me you didn't see that translucent white figure just passing right by us. We, we, we could be seeing things. I'm not imagining things. Yeah, well, I, I mean, I saw things too. I, I, I saw what happened to Josh in the shed. You know, that, and that's, that's what I'm worried about. Oh, Chris, I know, I know. You know what I'm really worried about? Okay, I'm worried about Sam. What, what, what's happened to her? If there's some maniac out here, then she could be dead too. Don't say that, please, Chris. Oh no. What is it? Sam's bracelet. And she never takes this thing off. We gotta find her. Fast. Look, 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 Chris. You can see in the windows. See what? It's tiny furniture? No. It's a whole scene with dolls and everything. Yeah. Huh, I, I guess you need a key if you want to play around in there. Wait, Chris, 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 the ghost! What? Didn't you see it? No. You were looking at your phone, you dip. What are you tweeting? Hashtag, there's a freaking ghost after us. Ash, calm down. Okay, there is no ghost here. G ghost of what? You, you're freaked out because of what happened with Josh. You're not paying attention. I saw it. I saw a ghost, and it looked like Hannah. It looked wait, like wait, Hannah. Wait, 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 what? Her baby bat. Jesus, Ash. What, what, what do you think? They followed us up here from the seance? I don't know. Maybe. They didn't because ghosts don't exist, okay? Oh, okay, who was talking to us at the seance, Chris? I don't know. How does a picture just jump off the wall like that? There's no handle. Here you go. Oh my god! There! Look there, Chris! You can't tell me you didn't Whoa, see that! That's, uh, see? That's uh You do see it! Yeah, I don't know. I I I I just, I just it's fucking crazy. Chris, it's showing us the way. Oh this is unbelievable. I feel like the ghost wanted me to see this. What what? Whoa, 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 what is going on here? Oh, God, it's, it's like... It's not like anything, that's us. Hiding there, waiting for Hannah, last year. But it's, it's so accurate. I mean, that's exactly where I was sitting, and that's where Matt was. This was set up by someone. Who was there? Or someone, or something that was watching us. Maybe it's a warning. I think someone... I think someone put this here to mess with us. No, it has to be the ghost. It's trying to tell us the maniac killed Hannah and Beth. I think it's this bastard that he's, he's here trying to fuck with our heads. Why would he set this all up, Chris? He's trying to tell us that he's going to come after us all, too. Dikes! Oh, no! It's... 
It's Hannah's diary. Everyone being together here on the mountain is gonna be so awesome. Cozy fires and hot tubs and OMG, Mike, I am so psyched to spend some time with him. I can't read this. It's so sad, Chris. From down there. Chris, for real. I saw something, but, but where'd it go? Hey, hey, look at this. It's a catalog for industrial light bulbs. That is so random. Look, one of the bulbs is circled. Yeah, it's a powerful bulb. when you think it can't get any creepier. Oh. Oh, jeez. There's a whole nother room through here. It's mammoth. Chris, I don't know if I want to keep going. Where in the world are we now? Are you kidding me? Did you know this was here? This, this is like a whole nother hotel. I had no idea this was here. I don't think I can take any more of this. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm about at my limit here, too. All I wanted to do was forget last year ever happened, and... To be honest, I'm not sure what Hannah thought she was doing. Yeah, well, you know how it is when you're crushing pretty hard on somebody. Great, so you're basically saying that we put a vulnerable friend in a terrible situation and essentially caused her to run away and never to be heard from again. If 
it was you, don't you think you would have run away? I mean, who likes being made fun of? <laughs> People don't make fun of me. To your face. What? Chris, we made her look so stupid in front of all of her friends and the guy she liked. I can't imagine doing anything worse to somebody. Newspapers. That's a really good question. You know what? No. Ash. No, I've had enough. I'm not going down any further into this nightmare, Chris. Ashley, I understand, okay? I'm really freaked out, too, but if Sam's down there all alone with a maniac and we leave, we're basically killing her ourselves. God damn it. Ashley, come on. Why are you always right? I'm not always right. Well, when you're right, you're right. I don't want to be. I want to leave. No. We've got to find Sam. Let's go. Chris, I'm getting a really weird feeling from all this. What do you mean? Well, I just, I can't shake the feeling that those fake newspapers have something to do with the guy who killed Josh. Wait, wait like, like, like what? Like it's a setup or something? Yeah, but I mean, how? It's just, it almost makes sense, but it just feels like we're missing something. to be kidding me, repulsive! This can't be for Edith. Why the hell is that here? It's like a goddamn grindhouse movie in here. I mean, wait, what is this, like a fucking hit list? Christ.
Oh god. Chris, it's from last year. Stupid prank. Uh, this is a little... This is a little uncomfortable, huh? I've never seen this video. I got your note. She's just so... Glad you can make it. So, what? She's so excited. And alive. She has no idea. Oh, jeez. Well, I forgot you were such a willful participant. This is horrible. Couldn't feel worse. Looks like you were enjoying yourself. That's the worst part, isn't it? We were just playing a joke. It was supposed to be funny. Yeah. I never want to see this video ever again. Oh. Slow down, okay? I can't handle this. Ghosts in these videos and everything just Just flying calm down. Around. Listen to me for a what? second. What? Calm down? Why should I calm down, Chris? I am freaking this out This has right got now. to be someone messing with us. What? Think about it. Ghosts don't hook up video cameras. They don't play games. Then who would set this all up? Seriously, I'm asking. I don't know. Maybe the same person who tied you up and killed Josh? Yeah, right. The same person who might have Sam right now. Maybe you're right. I wish I wasn't. Look at that. Blood? Might be Sam's. All right, let me see if I can get this. Yeah, I got it, but oh, damn, this thing is heavy. Be careful. You gotta come through, Ash. I, I can't hold it. Uh, oh, come on. Chris! Wait, to what? I think I just saw Sam over there. Uh, Ash, are you sure? I don't know, but come on. I think we should check it out. Uh, well, I'm pretty sure whoever's bleeding came through here, okay? So we really gotta get moving, like now. I'm coming. Oh. oh, thank God. I thought this thing was gonna crush me. Come on. I don't get it. Why would anybody want to make this place any cooler? It's freezing. God only knows what goes on inside this guy's head, Nash. Yeah, that's, those are Sam's clothes. That's just... Sick. I'd say that's just sick. So the psycho has been down here, for sure. Do you think he's still down here? I hope not. Why is this thing even here? Million dollar question.
Oh, Chris. Oh, no. Hello? Sam? Sam! Chris, is she dead? Holy shit, holy shit. She's not, she's not, she's not dead. How do you know? She's still breathing. What the hell is wrong? She's been knocked out. Oh, oh no, 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 no. This is bad, this is bad. We've got to get her out of here. Fred! Oh, shit! No, get back! Stay the hell away from me! Oh crap, Ash! Ash! Oh, Jesus, Ash, what did he do to you? I think he hit me. Shit, I'm gonna murder his fucking face off. <laughs> what is this? This is him. No, Chris. This is the guy who killed Josh. Oh, God. No, God. God! You murder a piece Chris. of shit? You monster! Oh, We're gonna die, Chris. I don't think I'm ready to die. No one is going to die. I wish I could tell you. It's just not fair! Ah! What? Tell me what? It's too late. Chris, what's the point? Stop it. Just say. We're always talking around it. And now, I mean, we've wasted everything. Ashley, none of it was wasted. What do you mean? Every second that I spent with you, was the only thing I ever wanted to do with my time. <laughs> what are you saying, Chris? I'm sorry. I, I should have told you how I felt. Oh, God, Chris. Ashley, oh. I swear when we get out of this. Oh, God. <laughs> no. Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't leave my. <laughs> Hello there, my special little subjects. <laughs> oh, so shit. Here, Chris. Don't be scared. Oh, you should be, Ash. Because here's the twist. Chris has made one fatal choice already today. No. And now, he must make another. Chris, you can take that gun in front of you and shoot Ashley. Or you can shoot yourself. Whoever is left can live. The choice is yours. Oh. <laughs> Don't you see? Huh? Don't you see that this torture porn has gone too far? Huh? Now, what gives you the right to play God in these people's lives? What makes you so special then? Huh? You're sick! You're a sick fuck! What the hell have you done to them, huh? What the hell have you done to them? Psychopath. Psychopath.
Oh my, thank God you found me. It's okay. It's okay. You okay? I, I don't understand. How did you get here? How'd you find me? There's a fucking maniac up here on the mountain. Yeah, I've noticed. He lives in this, like, web of tunnels. I was down there trying to get out, and then I found this crate, and I saw you. Listen, this guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos, too. And one of them showed Josh being killed, just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is going on around here? There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? What are you doing? Well, actually, the towel didn't turn out to be the best outfit for fighting off killer maniacs, you know? Do you mind, Mike? Oh, yeah. uh, right. My bad. Okay, done. Let's put this thing to bed. I'm into that. What's that? Is that... crying? Here, 
those 600 bucks, it'll be worth it or the great in that top. All right, now we're talking. on.
busted elevator's my only way out. Weird. Really weird.
Come on, for fuck's sake. Son of a bitch. My God, finally something works. Lovely. Danger is my middle fucking name.
was down here. Josh. <laughs> Josh. <laughs> Josh. Oh, oh, very good. <laughs> Every one of you, you got my name. <laughs> and after all you've been through, good, 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 good. I mean, how does that feel, right? How does it feel? Do you enjoy feeling terrorized, humiliated? I mean, panicked? All those emotions that my sisters got to feel once one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No, nope, no, 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 they're gone. I don't know if you noticed this, Josh, but none of us are laughing. Oh, come, 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 come. Why the long faces? Come on. It's good to get the heart racing every now and then, right? And race, they did. I mean, every one of you just pitter-pat, pitter-pat. I hope you appreciated my little phantasmagorical spectacle. I mean, no detail too small, no happen? opportunity missed. It was such a delight to play the puppet master to, to all of your Pavlovian panic. <laughs> and, and all that gore, I mean, gore, there was gore galore, fake bodies. I mean, God, that shit was expensive. And no retakes, nope, 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 only double takes. Oh, you should have seen your faces. Hook, line, and sinker for every little stinker. <laughs> Josh, why are you doing this? Yeah, don't even ask this squirrely little runt. He's got no clue. He's out of his fucking tree. He's definitely off his meds. Oh, come on, you guys. Revenge is the best medicine. You're done. Yeah. Mike, he's sick. What? Come on, you guys are all gonna thank me when you guys become internet sensations. Wait, what? what? Oh, you better believe this little puppy's going viral, ladies and germs. I mean, we got unrequited love we got we got blood i don't think there's enough hard drives in china to, to count all the views we're gonna get you guys what are you talking about you asshat jessica's fucking dead what did you hear me jessica is dead 
and you are gonna fucking pay, dick! <laughs> Guys, come on. Seriously, this is crazy, you know? Shut up. Why'd you hit her, man? Huh? Why'd you have to fucking hit her? Ah! What are you talking you about? You punched Ashley, you piece of shit. Mm. Oh. I got so mad. You don't hit a girl. You just don't. Dude, dude, Chris, bro, I... And I'm not your bro. Where are we going? Where are you guys taking me? Locking you up, bro. What? You can't do anything stupid before we call the police in the morning. Come on. I didn't do anything. Are, are you serious, bro? Goddamn murderer is what you are. Uh, I didn't do it. Michael, please, just listen to me, man. I did not hurt Jessica. I, I, are you insane? Like, like, like really? Did, do you not understand what you've done? I'm a healer, man! I bring people together! Not like you assholes. That's enough. You only see what you want to see. You're Stop talking! You are ah, dude. Ah, it's not my fault. You suckers can't take a joke. Ugh. Oh, oh wait. Did I hurt you? Did you just you feel a little, a little bit of pain mm. right now? I am so, so ah. sorry. Ah, stop it. Jesus, dude. Stop. Michael, I'm sorry, man. I can't tell you how sorry I am that something happened to Jessica, but I swear. I swear to you, I have no idea what happened to her. Josh, be, be honest with me. Do you, do you really expect us to trust you for a single goddamn second after all the shit you put us through? <laughs> well, can't we all just get along? <laughs> ah! Damn it! <clears throat> Not dicking around. This is not how it's supposed to go down. You're just a bunch of bullies. You can't hang out a, a guy just to dry like this, guys. Huh? Not like, not like you got the guts to really do anything about it anyways. Ah! Really, really, really need to shut up, man. Oh. Oh, oh that, that's, I, I, I mean, I, I, I don't even know what you mean because I, I don't have anything to regret. Oh my God. Ah. Okay, you're tying me up now, okay. Stay still, right, man. Right, 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 still. Well, can't, can't tie him up if they just wiggle around. Gosh, dude. I need me a little wiggle room, huh? What does it take to shut you up? Oh, not so tight, okay? Not so tight, okay? Okay, we can Those plastic ties, that's where it's... What? Yeah. In God's name, what is he talking, talking, talking about? This is hard to watch. Your hostage type is here. You ever seen this guy shit before? for at least oh, three hostages like or this. your money back! <laughs> Everybody's stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Chris and Ash. Chris is an ass. Ashley's a dumb dumb. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, what did you say? Well, I said you're a dummy, dummy. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, Ash. Oh, I never imagined in my wildest dreams that you liked me. Stop. <laughs> you know what that sound is? It's the sound of never kissing Ashley, you pussy! Stop! Yeah, you know, you might as well let Ashley sleep with Mike. I mean, at least he's got some notches in his belt, you know? He'll treat her right! You fucking 
pathetic, Christopher. I'm gonna beat his head off. Don't listen to him. Not worth it. Hey, Mike. Mike, 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 Mike. Mike, what? What happened with Jess, Mike? You know what happened. No. No, I... I don't. I got a problem, Mike. I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. No, I mean, like, I feel like I, I would remember killing her, you know? She's a soft. And she's probably got, like, a really tight bod. Shut your fucking mouth! Seriously? What? Did you think I was gonna shoot him? I, I don't know. Come on, Chris. You know me better than that. Yeah, Chris. You know me better than that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, just next time, give me a heads up, all right? Oh, you poor little piggies. You can't even get your good cop, bad cop routine to work. Leave it to the pros, bros! Why don't you go back to the lodge? Make sure everything's all right. I'll stay here with this lunatic until the morning. Oh, sleep over. Hey, can we order pizza? <laughs> you sure you're okay? Yeah. The one I know everything's fine back there. Yeah, you're right. See you in the morning.
is gonna be the way. now. You were screaming bloody murder. Are, are you okay? You totally won. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out Did you there. guys split up? A monster, it's a Wait. monster. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I, I don't feel anything. I just need to calm down. It was moving so damn fast. What? I just had to get away. Away from what? There, there was this, this thing, whatever it was. And, and, and you can relax. Josh was messing with You're us. You're not listening to me. Can you tell us exactly what happened? I am trying to tell you. We were climbing up the tower and it... It fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mines. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What mines? There are these mine shafts all over running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell? How'd it fall? I, I was walking down there in the mines and it was dark and I found this pile and... There was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head, I found Oh it. my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Listen, in in the tower, there was there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh, God, Yeah, yeah, Mike. barely. What about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. She's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I 
don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Good. Do it already. Whoever it is, it's probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. I got the gun. <laughs> Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, oh, what the... All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Oh, responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What is he talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I want to get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. <laughs> You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Ah. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he, he can't be. I, we, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. He going alone is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe, and don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh... Yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. This is the end. You point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me. I know. Hey. Come back safe. Come on. We need to hurry, son. I, uh... See you soon. So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. Uh, what's, uh, what, what's a guy gotta know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you'll be shooting it a long time. 
You mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them, if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. It's gross. Well, what, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well... They adhere to some patterns. Like any animal. Or human. Well, you mean, like how? Like they've got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Any, uh, pro-Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something? Uh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that? I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. If these things, Wendigos, are or, or, or were human, do they, they still have some aspect of humanity in them? Well, they retain certain things. I mean, it... Oh, no. Damn it, what happened? Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Quiet. We gotta go. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He could still be out there. <laughs> First, a Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And then he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. So the launch then. Yeah. Let's go now. It might still be near. Oh, 
long. It's not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it uh, tore him apart right in front of me. Oh, God. All right. Are these all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. That fucking thing got a hold of Josh. Then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. M? What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? It's uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? There had been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. God. Some of them survived, but like 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some like big cover up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody'd been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um, um, what is, huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my God, oh my God, it's, oh it's my nothing. God. nothing, oh it no, just, it, oh it no, bit no. me and... It bit you, what bit you? The, the Wendigo. The what? It's nothing, really, it's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really, it's, it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike. You got to go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I Emily. am. Emily. You can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do, and I don't want to see it again. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? The door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh, no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh, my God, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mike, calm down. You're... You're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. No. Not for us. Don't, don't do this! I'm really sorry. Fuck, I can't do this. Oh my god. You did the right thing. I hope you did. Maybe. For now. Shit. Fuck, fuck. 
Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. What the hell? You okay? I thought that, that he was gonna help us. It's a flamethrower, dude. Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've gotta be tough. We've gotta do this on our own. I don't know if I can. This guy's a little OCD. There's a lot of history to this. This says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. says that the bites, it, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry, what did you say? Um, it says she'll be okay. It says what? You're gonna be fine. Fine? Mike almost shot me, is that he fine? Didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair, she was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's None no, of us know. There's no excuse. There's no excuse please, for Emily, this. Please, just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've got to get to Mike. Like, now. Joshua, you should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. 
No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become, huh? Now, why did you hurt him? It's yourself that you despise, huh? You've already admitted as much. But they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake, and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. They did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry, at least, until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture. Just a game? Well, I hope for your sake, Joshua. You can find redemption. Shit. Huh. What happened on the walls?
Holy hell. I just need a pitchfork and a mob. Happy to see me again, huh? Hey. I was hoping I'd run into you again. All right. Good boy. All right, pal. Come with me. All right. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place. So, we're not flying blind. 
There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? I couldn't have said it better myself. Atta boy. Dokey boy, calm down. Wish I could move like you, Wolfie. I'm stuck on this side. All right, there goes nothing. Awesome. You got moves. Don't I, Wolfie? Doors were built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? What went on here? This is nuts. Disgusting.
is happening. Time, boys. It's enough for me for all you.
So, what have we here? Hey, buddy. Come on down. It's all right. Okie dokie, bud. Hey, I'll catch you on the flip side, huh? Guys, hurry up! We gotta find Mike. Come on. Hey, I'm I'm, I'm kind of gimping out here, guys. Um, I think maybe you should go on without me. No, Chris, we are not leaving you. We're sticking together. Mike will just have to wait. Mike must have locked it behind him. Crap! There's got to be another way in. Wait. Hey, what about this? I mean, should, should we try it? Well, it's not like we got a whole lot of choices here. Maybe the last place I would want to be right now. So who's going first? <laughs> After you. Is 
It's not so bad. You think this is the tunnel to the sanatorium? Of course it is. Where else would it go? Chris, I know you're hurt, but you gotta move it, all right? I'm trying, Ash. Mm. We should close this, right? Huh? I mean, what if something's following us? Yes, fine, close it. But we gotta keep moving. Can you just catch up, please? Yeah. Who's there? Anybody? Jessica! Is it you? God, I am so glad to see you. Glad you're safe. Look. Look there. Wow, great. The ladder's toast. We're never gonna make it up there. No, 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 I think I can. I think I can do it. It's like a rock wall. I'm gonna keep going. You should head back to the lodge. I've gotta get Mike. Good luck. Do it.
Which way? You all right? Uh, define all right. Alive, for a start. Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. These sessions are of any help to you now. <laughs> Just won't listen to me, and things seems pretty <laughs> fucked up. Hmm. So I I'm gonna leave you now, Josh. It's time you learn. There's more to be afraid of that can be dreamt up by the unhinged imagination of a self-indulgent, spoiled little brat! You have so many people who cared about you, who were willing to help, but at every turn you choose to push them away, now you're all alone. <laughs> Though by the sounds of things, you won't be alone for long. No, you won't be alone for long. Deep breaths, Josh. Deep breath. No. Yeah. 
to me. You can't, you can't tell me what to do. You can't tell me what to do anymore. Oh, okay. Okay. I trust you. I trust you. I trust you. You're not real. You're all alone down there. No, no. No, 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 not again. All alone. Oh. But you're with us now. Family. Get, get away! Get away from me! Get away! Why didn't you save us, Josh? Why did you want I us didn't to want die? You to die? I swear. I swear I tried to find you. Someone who worked in the sanatorium? There was so much weird shit happening up there, that wouldn't even begin to surprise me. What kind of weird shit? Someone was capturing the Wendigos. Had them all tied up in these restraints. I saw some real fucked up shit. Wow. I must have just let them all out when I blew the place up. Huh. Smooth move. I think we're close to the lair. How can you tell? I don't know, I just feel really terrible all of a sudden. Did I? I really don't want to go in there. There's no other way through. Mike, is that what I think it is? Shit, looks like a grave. Look, there was a cross here. So this is where she was buried. But who dug her up? Let's keep moving. It's okay. You sure? I'm not dead yet. Famous last words. <gasps> oh, it's freezing. Let's move my face. I know, I know. Just keep moving. Nobody likes cold minds. Although yours are great. Just never mind. <gasps> Wait a minute. I thought you reached the deepest part. Why did you say that? Okay. Like, you're ready to be sure. 
I'm sorry, Beth. I have no choice. It's the only way I can survive anymore. If someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. What does it mean? Jesus. That's Michael, it's ridiculous. Michael, it has to be. It's the only thing that makes sense. Beth died in the fall. So what? What does that mean? So Hannah must have buried her. God damn it. God damn it. Hannah was down here. I don't believe any of this. She would have been starving. She would have been desperate. Fuck! We need to find Josh. Right now. Open up again. We're gonna make it. God, don't jinx it. Right. Oh. Come on. Come on. We made it.
Uh. Oh. oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Uh. Oh, 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 wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I think I saw something. No, 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 I don't, I don't take orders from you. I don't take orders hey. from you, you can't, hey, you can't tell me what to do. You can't Josh? tell me what to do Buddy. anymore. You can't tell me what to do. Oh, okay. Okay, I trust you. I trust you. I trust you. Oh! 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 What's the matter with Mike? He's tripping or something. Josh! M M Mike! Josh! Hey, man! Don't, don't hit me, please, please, please. Well, you were deep in it, man. Full mental jacket. We didn't think we'd get you back. Josh, Hannah was down here for weeks, a month. She dug us up. Sam. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Josh, do you have the key for the cable car? Uh, yeah. Here. Oh, God. See that over there? That means there's a direct way out. Come on. There's no way Josh is gonna make it up there. Okay, if you help me up, I can go back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah, yeah, good. You bring Josh back the way we came, and we'll all meet at the lodge. Be careful. Hey, you too. All right, let's go, you fucked up son of a bitch. You didn't, you didn't have to hit me so much, man. Uh, yeah, uh, I'm sorry about before, man. I, I thought you killed Jess. I was wrong. No. No. Still alive. 
something and I don't want to freak you out but there's there's some kind of thing on the mountain it's not human it's like a monster it came after me it Jess it fucking pulled me down here into this fucking nightmare Jesus Christ I'm sorry don't freak out please no oh, god can you move yeah come on Jess Come on. Come on. Come on, come on.
if we stay out here. Come on. We should do. We should check the basement. Might be someone left down there. If there's anyone left, they're probably in the basement. chances of survival. Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it.
No! Uh, the old man, I, uh... I, I don't know how to describe him, I mean... You said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah, we... <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you? He saved my life. And I watched him die. I heard Jessica. I don't know how or why she was down there, but I know I heard her. He held it right up to my face, right here, right in front of my nose, and he could have shot me. He almost shot me, the prick. I mean, you go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him, but man, this one really takes the cake. I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. I wasn't good enough. How did you end up in the mines? I was... Carried and taken and... What did you see? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. He was out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And... I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. I thought we were close. After his sister's... Disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought. I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to. I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience. I said I'm fine. I. I stabbed him and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know didn't know? Who did you stab? Oh, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the sauce and the gun and, oh my God. Where's Matt? Is he okay? Are they done looking at him? I'm just a little worried because, you know, I'm his girlfriend. Did he tell you that? I mean, I probably wasn't his favorite person there for a couple minutes, but he knows how devoted I am to him. He knows. He said he knows, right? Your friend Ashley, she told us she tried to help you. <sighs> she said she heard you calling out. <sighs> Not me. Like... What do you remember? He came for me. He did. Came for you? Where is he? Did he make it? You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, Sam? I've seen what's down there. And I'd give anything to unsee it. Is that? Oh, fuck. Oh. 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 Oh.